All right, guys, welcome back to Zero Plays uh, Super Double Dragon, or Return of Double Dragon, I should say, for the Super Nintendo. Last time, uh, we got through the missions three through five. Now we're on to mission six. I think this is one of the few levels in the game that we had changed. And if you're a fan of the Double Dragon series, you might recognize this forest stage. Ooh. As this is the forest stage in the first game where you fight two Abobos that break out of the wall. By the way, I gotta say, Abobos not in this game at all. It's kind of strange. There's actually some enemy types that aren't in this game at all that are staples of the franchise. So, you don't see Abobo at all, which is crazy. Another game- oh, another game I need to play is Abobo's Big Adventure. Uh, I know it's like a fan game, but I really want to play it. Oh shit, watch it for the rock. I don't mean Dwayne. Johnson. I'm so used to saying Dwayne the Rock Johnson, not just Dwayne Johnson. So like that's why my brain stopped me. So I was like, it's Dwayne jo it's it's Dwayne the Rock Johnson, not Dwayne Johnson. What? What the sword guy's freaking out in the corner? Look at him, look at him, he's freaking out. He's getting... I'm stuck. Uh, well, that didn't work. Come on. Fact. <laughs> Got him! He went into the pit. Well, that saves me some headache. And you can fall into the pit, too, so be careful. With these parts of the level, I like to get on this side. <sighs> oh, did he hit me point blank with that? Because then I can't fall into the pit. You can fall off on the side of the bridge, though. That is a pit as well. So just be careful. If you're in this stage. You can knock them into the pit if you get them if you get the enemies down far. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I died anyways. So it was low on HP. Okay. So this part sucks, because it's the bridge. There's some platforming. Though I will say the platforming in this Double Dragon is not nearly as bad as it is in earlier games. Or four, or any of the ones. But that's another thing I want to talk about. This was always known as the fourth Double Dragon game. In fact, the next game in the series is called Five. So it's very confusing now that we have a Double Dragon 4. Which is... It's okay. It's an okay game. I'll just say that much. I don't hate Double Dragon 4. I don't super care for it either. Um, so... I, oh, I can't believe I got hit by that. I am just not doing great. I did, okay. So I recorded a session of this uh, with one of my girls, uh, Karama, around, um, at doing commentary every so often. We were just in a voice chat we were showing. Um, and I did super well. And so, and, and I know that I'm saying, like, oh, I'm doing so bad, but I'm like, if this is bad, this is pretty good because, like, this game is super hard. I'm making it look easy, but it's fucking hard. Even with two people. I'm just gonna... Oh, backhand didn't work. Oh god, I'm losing my life. Oh. What did he do that? Did he armpit punch me? How dare, sir. Alright. There goes my th uh, third credit. Oh, here we go. We got fucking Arnold over here. The Arnold guys who are also in uh, fucking River City Girls. This must be the game they were from. Because a lot of people don't know that the Kunio and River City series is in the same franchise as Double Dragon. They're all the same franchise. They just take place in different areas. And actually, the Double Dragons are in um, River City Girls. Uh, they own the dojos. Ah, fuck. Nice, got a grab move off on him. <laughs> ah, damn it. Fucking Safari Man over here. I always called that guy Safari Man in my head, even before the Filthy Frank videos. 
Because he looked like he would go on an African lion safari. African lion safari. Oh, this funny thing, we're in the car. Um, looking for places to go and eat. Oh no, this is the final stage, mission seven. Okay, there's not ten missions, there's ten. There's seven. But this is a long one. And in fact, this version is longer than the version that is in the Super Nintendo, or the Super Double Dragon. You don't even fight the final boss in Super Double Dragon. Well, you do fight it, but he's a lot weaker, there's a lot less to the fight. Um, but uh, yeah, this is my favorite song in the game. Uh, and this stage is awesome. It's long. It might be two parts. We'll see what happens. Hmm. So I'm already five minutes into this episode, and I'm gonna have to cut it soon. Um, but I might just have to make this a super long one and then just to cut it down. Um, so there we go. Uh, so, anyways, yeah, we were talking about jingles, local jingles in the car, and uh... oh fuck. It's gonna be tough because there's other enemies around. And this one seems really punch happy. Okay, at least he's on one side of me. Down, up, down. I don't like that he's behind me. Luckily, it's only one of them, not like two of them. Okay. Come on, buddy. Um, but yeah, we were thinking of different jingles. I can't sing any of them because I'll dox myself. Um, but uh, there's a lot of jingles from my youth that I remember that were on the radio and stuff. Um, I was in church. And all that time to charge it. Oh, dick. I like to do this zigzag pattern because it gets in the ground a little bit. God, I love this song. Like, one of my top favorite Super Nintendo songs. Got him. Okay. I think that means I make it to the next screen. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> The elevator. Oh, hey, another elevator segment. You know what that means. Enemies that pile on and can fall off. But he didn't fall off. I wish he had. What? Come on, fall off. Oh, they can't? Why would you give me the illusion uh, of that? Oh. <clears throat> okay. At least you get some invincibility there. Okay, more enemies. Reminds me of my Double Dragon 4 Nagra. Double Dragon 4? More like Double Dragon Whore. Hey, <laughs> genius. <laughs> I need to make more Nag videos. I enjoy making those. And people seem to like them, so... I actually haven't made too many serious videos this year. I've made two joke videos. I did make one serious video. And I'm gonna make more of them. I have scripts for them, I just... Making review videos and like editorial videos is a little priority for me. Because uh, I have more fun doing the Let's Plays in the stream. The streaming the most. I don't have any plan to get rid of Let's Plays, though. Because Power Plays is still fun for me. Oh. Zero Plays is still fun for me. Oh. <clears throat> oh, man. That's bad, Harper. <laughs> that was actually meant for him, but the other dude, but I'll take it. Ah! Why is my Fitbit going off? I don't know. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. <laughs> but yeah, you can get through this game in like <clears throat> less than an hour. I think my my best time is like 49 minutes. <clears throat> Just playing through it solo. 
Oh, there's two of those guys. I can't do this like this. Uh, gotta, oh my god. This screen is tough. <coughs> gotta zigzag him. Okay, he's down at least. There we go. So now it's just me and Clown Boy. <laughs> Come on. Come on, Clown Boy. Fuck. Got him. Come on. I know it's cheap. This is the easiest method to beat these guys. <clears throat> Come on. I'm back on screen. So I can get you. Turn the gun towards him. Uh, he's good in close quarters like that. Got him. Okay. <clears throat> Is that next screen? Yes. <clears throat> I barely have any health left. So, in this, the North American version, this is where you would fight the final boss, this room. But actually, there's a whole other section of the map that gets cut off from that version. Ugh. Oh. <clears throat> Figured that would happen. Both of them on one side, on either side of me, of course. Oh god, there's a Terminator guy too. They just want to throw all the bosses at me, don't they? Yeah, a lot of people I think say this game is cheap and rushed because there's like no story to the game. Unless you have the instruction manual, which explains the story. Okay, he's dead. Oh my god! <sighs> of course, dude isn't. Fucking Arnold over here. Trenchcoat Arnold. That's your name, Trenchcoat. Trenchcoat Arnold. God, if <clears throat> there's a screen in, in River City Girls where you have to fight like four, five, six of these guys, and holy fuck, it was like one of the hardest screens of the game. It took Sky and I like, <clears throat> oh, like six, seven attempts to beat that screen. These guys aren't that bad in this game, but holy shit, are they bad. Uh, <clears throat> River City Girls. So this part, this is all cut. From here on, this is content that was only in the Japanese version. Or the re-release that came out a little while ago. The re-release, by the way, is hard to recommend because the carts aren't the best made. Apparently, on original hardware, they, like, overheat. Um, on certain ver revisions of original, like, Super Nintendo's, they overheat. But on, like, clone consoles, they're, like, fine. Because they did most of their testing on consoles. Now, primarily, I use a clone console, but I do have a SNES, too. Uh, I do want to mod it at some point to use RGB. Or maybe just get another Super Nintendo and buy one for cheap. Uh, I mean, there's a parts one I can get. Let the sky look at for me. Okay, that's not death. I always think that's gonna be death, but it's not. Dude, buddy can't get up there. Actually, did quite well. Oh, fuck, got me. Clever girl. What do you really want to get? You got less space up here, but it works out because you don't have that other end to deal with. Damn it! Just when I was going to release it. Yeah. 
Stay over there. Oh, okay.